Uh, hello YouTube, my name is uh, Jeffrey and I will be uh, doing an art tutorial. Um, uh, today we're going we're gonna to be drawing um, Garnet from Steven Universe. I'm sure everyone knows who this is. Uh, now, um, I have some experience in art. I I'd say um, I'm better than most. Like, uh, I I it's not a brag, I, I just think that um, I, I am better than most, most people who, who, who do art. Um, on uh, DeviantArt and all those sites. So, anyways, we're gonna just get, get straight into it. We're gonna like just get a get the brush tool and just like just go at it. You know, like when you start drawing, you're gonna just you're gonna just wanna you know just go with it. Just kind of draw however you feel. Darn it looks. Darn it is is kind of blocky. She kind of. Has, has this kind of shit going and then these I'm throwing back memory by the way um if you if you need to use references you're not a good artist uh just thought you might want to know that so Donna kind of looks like this and then she kind of does this down here she has like big thighs now I've done that a bit too small that's okay we're just gonna resize her we're just gonna we're, we're just gonna resize her like this Put in the in the center of the in the center of the um file. And so now we're we're drawing the arms and um now I'm I'm gonna be honest I'm not very good at arms and I'm especially not good at hands. But uh, that's okay because we can we can hide them. You see, uh huh. Hide them underneath the frame of the of the drawing that way you don't have to draw them okay now um let's get into some detailing garnet uh has like a has dimensionality to her uh, hair so we're just gonna add that right here give her give her some some muscles musculature is important um learn your anatomy when you draw you want to know what all the muscles are these are abs uh, oh, oh shit. Okay, so, on to, hold on, no, okay, let's do a background. We're gonna do a background, uh, a simple one, we can just have like a line back here. Make sure to, to, um, always use black, always use, always use black for, um, for outlines and uh, always always use outlines in your drawings because because um, if you don't uh, then you're not drawing you're painting so anyways we're gonna we're gonna start coloring this and we're just gonna take the paint bucket tool uh, garnet is purple so we're gonna make it purple yeah you can just use a paint bucket tool I don't, I, like I see a lot of digital artists uh, just kind of going in with, like, like scribbling in here. Like, uh, uh, what's the point? Like, you, ca you have to get you, you get them for times. The you got the paint bucket tool. It's so easy. Just do this. Just fuck. Just use the paint bucket. Just use the paint bucket tool. Now I don't. Now I don't know what, what colors I'm using, but um, you know, th this is where your creative license comes in. You can make on it however you feel, how well, whatever colors you feel she should be. Now, yeah, see what, what I just did here. This, what, this, um, yeah, so, and then you fill it in like that. So, so then, um, so, and then, and then the, <coughs> and, and then the, and then the and then the background, um, now you just want to use whatever colors you feel like is right. Um, it's just like, as I said before, um, like, you, you, like these colors down here, I find are, like, usually pretty ugly. You want to stick, like, hugely up here where it's bright and vibrant and, um, just kind of dial this to whatever color you feel is right. And then just, just paint bucket it on. Oh, shit. That's fine. Um, 
and then you got the sky. That's good. And um the trees. Yeah. Now now the way that I've drawn that tree, um, I can't get the leaf leaves color in there. You know, the the leaf color. That you know, that's fine. That's part of the style. It's part of um Steven Universe's um uh, minimalist aesthetic. <coughs> you know, you know, it's like it's like what they teach at Cal Arts. Let's finish this up. Okay. Uh, now we're on to shading. Uh, shading. You just want to take a, a a big a big brush, turn down the hardness on that thing. Um, maybe. Yeah, uh, maybe turn down the opacity as well. Uh, now, for dark areas, you just want to turn that bro turn that black. What you can do is uh, make a mask so that when you oh fuck, or when you when you color oh fucking god, yeah. So ah, you see now when I color in, it's all in the all inside, yeah, so, oh fuck, it's all inside, and so you just want to, you know, just kind of give everything a nice, nice dark outline, because, you know, shadows, they're, they're just on, like, the dark side of things, and the dark side of things is usually... Usually on the um on the on the edges edges of things where it's, it's darkest. So you just want to get that in there here as well. That's where there's like a fold or something. I don't know. Uh, dark there, and then you want to add highlights, and this is the same thing. So maybe turn the brush size down. Here we can add the the shine on Garnet's sunglasses. Yeah, we can add maybe like a little shine on her, on her hair, and um, these are shoulder pads, whatever. Um, I think we're done. No, you can you can shade the um the um the background as well. Oh, fuck, that's too much work. No, it's done here. Yeah. Okay, so um, I, I went and uh, rewatched Steven Universe, and I, uh, you know, I, I realized I got I got the colors a little bit wrong. Uh, that's okay though. I, I fixed them up. In the it, it, it's not that's that's not, that's research. It's not referencing. I I don't uh, referencing is when you when you copy someone else's work. So uh, this isn't referencing. Uh, so yeah, this is this is completely original. Don't steal it. Um, so, uh, anyways, that, that's the end of the tutorial. That's it. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, yeah, uh, subscribe or whatever. I don't, I don't know.